Hi everyone and welcome back to Let's Play Kingdom. So, we are not in a great position right now, but I'll see what we can do. I'll keep playing until we lose the crown, basically. And I really want a new run to be in its own episode. So, if this run ends quickly, this is just going to be a shorter episode, basically. Which I know is not ideal, but... Yeah, I want new runs to be in their own episode. Anyway, let's re-recruit these people. And you know, I play this game because it's fun. Not because it's my mission in life to beat it or whatever. <laughs> and that's all of our gold, unfortunately. The one big problem is that the scythe are so damn expensive. So if you lose all the farmers in an attack, you are kind of screwed. Fortunately, we have one left. Which is not great, but it's better than nothing. Do we have any gold here? I don't think so, no. Just the one gold piece behind us. Which is actually useful, because that gives us five gold. And that's enough to buy a scythe. Could have been worse. As I said, we probably won't recover from this. But I'll keep playing until we lose the crown, and then we'll just start a new run. Alright. Well, we need more gold, so we just have to wait. That's pretty much what we need to do. Yep, we'll wait. At least we got two farmers now. So that's going to be useful-ish. But not enough hunters around, unfortunately. We'll just need to recruit more archers. Not much point exploring with zero gold. Also, we could set up some more walls on this side. If we manage to get enough gold, then we can do it. Anyway, let's get the deer. We don't have to worry about attacks tonight. So we should be fine. But we need to wait until daytime. Hunters won't kill them during night time. We can just stand outside the camp tonight, it's fine. I do wish there was a way to tell which exact day it is. Because I don't always play this in one sitting. <laughs> Get back here. Where do you think you're going? Come on. No? I can play this game too. <laughs> Come on, turn back already, really? Aren't you bored running in one direction? There we go, that's better. Let's chase them back to our camp. Night is almost over. This should give us some gold. It's not a lot of gold. We need a ton of money right now. So just killing a deer or two won't really make a huge difference. But it's not like we got anything better to do during the night. So that's that. Yeah, day 22. We got four days before the next big wave. The next big wave might be the end of it, but we'll see. I'll try to set up decent defenses. The main problem is that we lost a lot of income during that attack. Okay, do we have any hunters around here? No, I guess not. I thought we had at least one. I guess we don't. Alright then. Well, that's the biggest problem, because... We can't get them easily. And we don't even have knights yet. Once you get knights, getting hunters is almost impossible. I don't think this will be a lot of money. No, not really. Enough to get a few more archers, I suppose. We'll just spend all of it on archers, because we need archers. Let's try this again. We don't have knights yet, so... It shouldn't be too hard to get hunters, still. It mostly sucks after you get knights, since each knight needs four archers assigned, if I'm not mistaken. Okay, let's try to get these two as well, I just need to wait a moment. Come on. Alright, let's go. Also, we still need to find the other statue. It has to be beyond one of the portals. Because there's no other option. 
it's as simple as that. Which does kind of suck, because I would really like to get a buff to my walls before the next big wave. Ah, screw that one. I don't want to waste too much time chasing them. We need to do other things. Well, that was not quite good enough, unfortunately. Get back here. There we go, that's better. That's free gold. And more gold, nice. Okay, that's much better. Now, we need more farmers, because we need steady income. And farmers are pretty much the only way to get steady income right now, without having to chase deer all day. Now let's get a few more scythes. We do have two farms, one on the west side, one on the east side. We also still need more archers. And we need to upgrade our defenses. We need a lot of things, basically. This needs to be rebuilt. This also needs to be rebuilt. In fact, we should have done that a little bit earlier, I suppose. Because we might get attacked from this direction. Do we actually have builders? No, I think we lost all of our builders, did we? I think we actually did. Yeah, I should have recruited a builder. A little bit too late for that now. Any more gold from you? No? Unfortunately not. Okay then. Hopefully it's not going to be a very big wave. I can always drop one gold piece. And I suppose I can drop it on the west side in advance. Because east side is mostly fine. Yeah, that's quite a few dudes. Yeah, east side is mostly fine. It's mostly west side that's the problem. We don't have any more gold that we can drop. They are down. I hate how these archers just stand right here. They are so useless over there. We are mostly fine. From the looks of it, just need to get that builder. Quickly. Preferably more than one, but we only have enough gold for one at the moment. We got three more days. This is almost definitely not enough time to prepare for the next big wave. But we'll see what we can do. This game just snowballs in either direction. If you do poorly in the first 5-10 days, you will just lose eventually from the snowball effect. If you do well in the first 5-10 to 10 days, the later nights won't be as much of a problem, because again, you will also snowball. This is basically a game of a snowball effect, the way I see it. You need to do well early on. And not mess up. It's pretty easy to make, like, one basic mistake. And then you just lose. Not right away, but you lose eventually. Okay, I'll take that. Just waiting for that wall. Well, actually... We need to find that other statue. But I still want better income. I might upgrade the walls as well. And more watchtowers. We could also just recruit a lot of archers. That's probably slightly better. Just recruit a lot of archers. But the problem is that if the walls fall, the archers will die very quickly. And yes, I know they don't literally die, they just lose their balls. You know what I mean. Can we get one more deer? Probably not. Come on. Get over here. Okay, we can get one. But this is already a little bit too late. So, are we going to get dodds from this general direction? Let's check the portal. Just to know. Yeah, it's active. Alright then. We need to go back. I'm not recruiting these people. Because we'll just lose our gold that way. I hope we can get back to our camp fast enough. If not, that might be a bit of a problem. Come on. Alright, let's go. We need to be faster. The deer will probably run away, but I'm not turning back now, when it's already night time, or almost night time. We can get them tomorrow. Yeah, just let it run away.
more gold. So... We need more archers, basically. I could just focus on recruiting archers exclusively. It's probably not going to be good enough. At least I don't think it will be good enough. This seems rather unlikely. And this wall really needs an upgrade. This one wall is not going to be enough. I can guarantee it's not going to be enough. So we kind of have to upgrade this one. There's really no way around it. Would be nice to upgrade the inner watchtowers as well. We already have a stone wall on this side. Let's get one more scythe. It will improve our income. That's just a regular wave. Shouldn't be a big problem. The wall should hold. This is a fully upgraded wall. I can't upgrade it any further. Well, unless there's something I don't know about. But I'm pretty sure it's not possible to upgrade this any further. Okay, day 14. We got two more days before the next big wave, basically. Which is not a whole lot of time, really. We can go recruit more people. And that's probably about it. Yep, I guess we'll just go recruit more people. I wouldn't mind more gold. Okay, thanks. We can go west and see if the other statue is beyond the portal to the west. I could also still get a few more walls around here. But I don't think it's such a good idea. We won't be able to get a decent watchtower there. And we'll just lose the archers once the wall goes down. And I definitely won't have enough money to upgrade another wall to max level from nothing. Okay, two people. We'll grab them for sure. You're coming with me. These will be archers. We'll check just beyond the portal. We should have enough time to do that. Let's find out. More people. Yep, we should have enough time to recruit them. So you're coming with me. That's more archers. Here's the portal. Not sure if I should run beyond it. I guess I can always drop one gold piece. Oh, there's gold here. All right. Well, that was worth it then. Let's just drop one gold piece. Or he will grab that one. That was definitely worth it. And more people. I don't think I can recruit this guy. Also, I don't want to go too far. I think we need to go back already. Yeah, we need to go back. Otherwise, we'll just lose. Alright, let's go. We have enough gold for some decent upgrades. So the statue might be beyond the portal to the east. Well, unless it's much further to the west, which is also a possibility, I think. I hope not, because I want that wall buff. Alright, I need to drop a gold piece, unfortunately. Because we're not quite close to our camp. Come on, we need to get back faster. Alright, let's go. It's not night time yet, but it's about to be. Oh, nice. Thanks. Why are you this far away from our camp? You probably shouldn't be. Yeah, these guys are probably lost. I think so. We are nowhere close. It's still not night time yet, but they need to get back to our camp quickly. I think they might be lost. Anyway, let's see if we can upgrade something useful. Not the walls. First of all, archers. We need as many archers as possible. We probably need one more builder as well. We only have one builder. Literally one. Okay, more gold. I'll take that. Come on, more bows. Oh yeah, we have all of them already. So let's upgrade the walls then. I could get one more scythe, I suppose. Let's get one more scythe. And here comes the wave. Wait, wasn't the portal to the west active? Will we get waves from both directions at the same time? That's an interesting question. 
Let's fill the bows. We have quite a lot of gold, so let's get a hammer. And we'll upgrade this wall. Or the watchtower. Let's upgrade the watchtower. Archers on watchtowers are not 100% safe, but they are safe from some enemies. They aren't safe from flyers, for example. Okay, now we have to go east to get a buff for our archers. I'll just get one level, because we need that for one night. Let's go do that first, because that's way more important than anything else. Is that a guy we need to recruit? Yep. Okay, then. There's a camp over here, so we can recruit these people too. They will be archers. If this night goes well, we should be in a decent position. So, do we want to go further to the east? To see if we can get a buff for our walls. We can try. Let's try. If we can find that statue, that's going to be very useful. And the more people we can recruit. Yeah, let's grab these guys. This should be early enough, so that they can get back to our camp. We'll have to drop one gold piece? No, this is inactive right now. Okay. I don't want to go too far for the same reason as before. I need to get back to my camp before night time. Especially since this is going to be the big wave night. Okay, that's nice. Yeah, I don't want to go. Yeah, second portal. I'm not going beyond the second portal. So unfortunately, the other statue is nowhere close to us. That really sucks. I will not have enough time to run all the way to the west. Especially since we just explored to the west and the statue was nowhere close. It might be beyond the second portal, really. Which would be really bad for us. Well, this sucks because we won't get buff to our walls. Oh well. We'll see how it goes. The best case scenario is when you have both statues right next to each other. It happens, but it's obviously not guaranteed. As you can clearly see. I could upgrade this to max level, I guess. I've seen some disagreement about whether the level 3 buff is actually stronger than the le level 1 buff, or it just means that it lasts for 3 days. Everyone has a different opinion about that. And I've not seen any solid proof of either. Anyway, we're going with one level. That gives us some money to get more archers, probably do other stuff. This is actually more gold than we need. I leave some gold over there, we can't carry any more anyway. So let's upgrade things. I leave that gold there. I think I'll upgrade this wall, because I pretty much assume the outer wall will fall to the big wave. If we can upgrade this fast enough, that's great. And more archers. We got two builders. They probably won't be able to get both. Okay. Well, that's it. This is Blood Moon Night. So, yeah, I think I'll just drop some gold here. Actually, hold on, they will come from the west side. Yeah, they will come from the west side, because the eastern portal was inactive. On the other hand, the western portal was active earlier, and we got away from the east. It was a little bit strange. Right, in any case, I'll drop some gold. Yep, they are coming. I can just run into them and it will be the exact same effect, I think. I'm pretty sure it will be basically the exact same effect. Okay, well... We got as many of them to leave as we possibly could have. My crown! This might be bad. Basically, I'd rather lose the gold than tools, people. This might actually happen. But that's quite a few flyers. Well... The wall will go down for sure, I think. I can still drop some gold. My crown! We got it. We don't have any more dudes. Yeah, and now we lost scythes. I hate losing scythes because you basically lose 5 gold with each one. Well, this is not going to happen. We can't handle these giants. Yeah, I don't think we can recover from this. 
Probably not. So this is going to be a restart. Just let them take the crown or whatever. Alright, we're going to start a new run in the next episode. I hope you enjoyed this one anyway. Thanks for watching and I'll see you next time.